everyone, my name is Valerie. Welcome to the owner's class video for the Singer Fashion Mate Model 3333 sewing machine. In this video, we're going to go over some great stuff like threading a needle, winding a bobbin, selecting a stitch, and a whole bunch more to get you started. In your box, you get obviously your machine, but you also get some cool stuff like this instruction manual full of some really great information. And for those who are really impatient, we also have this handy dandy quick start guide full of lots of great pictures to follow to get you started. Let's take a tour of the machine. This is the machine. So to get it working, first we need to plug it in. So you've got your power cord and foot pedal that you will plug into the side of your machine. And right above that is your off on switch. You'll know the machine is on when the lights come on. So up here we have our hand wheel, which has arrows on it that show that you always need to turn it towards you. And as I turn it, you'll see a take-up lever pop up. And that's really important when we start threading the machine. Down here we have the stitch selector dial, and above that the stitch length dial. Up on the top we have the bobbin winding stopper, the bobbin winding spindle, and a bobbin winding tension disc over here. This is the tension dial. Back here we have a threading guide and another guide. Here's that take-up lever again. Down here we have the reverse lever. This is so you can sew in reverse. Down here we have the needle, obviously. The all-purpose foot, which you'll use for most of your sewing. In the back we have a presser foot lifter. It's up when you thread, down when you start to sew. Your bobbin is right here along with the cover. And you can remove this piece to expose a free arm, which is great when you're sewing like cuffs, pant hems, anything circular. If you turn this around, it's got a door. And we have all of these extra accessories inside, such as extra bobbins, spool caps, um, and presser feet. And so before we thread the machine, let's look at some of these extra presser feet. In total, this machine comes with four presser feet. Now, the all-purpose foot comes already attached to the machine, and that one you'll use for most of your sewing. You also get a buttonhole foot, which makes buttonholes, and this foot is the long white foot with the red marks on it. You also get a button sewing foot, which is used to sew buttons onto your projects using the zigzag stitch, and that foot is the transparent one with like the little blue feet sticking out of the front. And lastly, you get a zipper foot, commonly used for inserting zippers, but you can also use it for making and inserting piping. Now, let's thread the machine.